Derby's first visit to Vale Park in 27 years. They've actually never won here. Derby's last victory on Vale soil all the way back in 1925, before Vale Park even existed. Third. Over to Roberts, who had to wait for the ball to arrive. Forward by Forsyth. Harahan's gone beyond this time. Decent ball in. McGoldrick with a little touch. Decent save by Stevens. Harvey might still have an opportunity. Barkhazen. Harahan delivers again. Stevens there again. And on we go. Mendes Lang. There's real pressure from Derby here. It's brave from Ojo. Where's he going there? There's enough in the end. Well, it's wonderful play from Haran. Watch this for a touch. Oh, unbelievable. Gets it down first time. Great ball into the box. But Goldrick gets ahead of the defender. And there's the second ball whipped towards the far post. And Stevens theatrically comes and punches it away. Daniel Mendesland gives chase. Politic. Oh, Corey Smith read that all day. Here's Mendes Lang. Here's a chance for Derby. And Barkhazen just couldn't wrap his foot around it. Well, I thought Nathaniel Mendes Lang might go for goal himself. Instead, he tried to tee up his teammate. I thought he was going to go hard and low towards that far post. He gets his head up and sees the run of Barkhazen. But it was just too much for him to get on the end of it. Good save from Wildsmith. First real test he's had. It's a brilliant save. Butterworth gets on the right hand side, strikes it well. And as soon as it leaves his foot, you think this could be destined for the far corner. In by Warren. Where's that dropping? It's gone straight into the palms of Joe Wildsmith. We don't quite deal with this first ball. Up it goes, it lands down at Smith and Politic. He strikes quickly with his left foot. Looked on by Harahan. Oh, Bird got the wrong side of Ojo. Now Barkhazen, the angle is tight. He tried to find McGoldrick in the middle. It's a really important interception that takes it behind for a derby corner again it feels like an opportunity missed though in great position for Barkhazen to find himself in oh here's Butterworth he will go for goal Wildsmith with the save but he can't stop the second it's Funzo Ojo who against the run of play in the second half has put Port Vale in front well, it was a disaster moment for Derby after having three or four really good opportunities in the second half. We haven't punished them, and that was a concern. Don't deal with this first, Paul. Don't deal with the second. And look at this, a 3v2. Again, I thought Butterworth made the wrong choice, but he does strike it well. Wildsmith makes the first save, but he just palms it back into the space where Ojo does everything right, he manages to keep the ball down, in control of it and finishes well. Let forward by Bird, settled down by McGoldrick, forward toward Barkhazen. Oh, pushed away by Stevens. One of Derby's better moments of football, that. That's a great bit of play, great pass into Barkhazen. He shoots first time on his left foot, lovely pass from Harahan, I think it was. Are going to throw everything at Port Vale in these final 15 minutes in search of an equaliser? And maybe more, who knows? The Scythe. Spots Dobbin. Lovely ball. Can he finish? What a pass from Fozzie. And Dobbin, as soon as he gets past the wing back, he just wasn't sure whether he'd have the composure and the quality to beat. 
Stevens in that 1v1. Good Corey Smith for Derby. Head for Mendes Lang. Smith's made a run forward. The ball was too heavy, but it's dropped from a goal trick. And now it's Dobbin. It was well wide and it needed to be on target. He was caught late as well. Well, it was a great first touch from Dobbin. And then at that point, he tries to find the corner. You haven't got time. Touch and you get your shot off. You see how he's just leaning back, trying to find a far corner. Way by Wild Smith. A goal trick. They've been looking for that ball out to Mendes Lang. Smith putting some pressure on. Knight is onto it. Now Dobbin, and there are bodies forward for Derby. Dobbin's cross. McGoldrick! They have found a way! David McGoldrick scores again! And Derby are level at Vale Park. 1 1. With all the opportunities we've had in the game, all the sights at goal, we've lacked the quality to finish it off. It's brilliant work from Dobbin down the left hand side. He cuts the ball back. At that point, McGoldrick arrives latest into the box, finds the far corner, side foot, and gets us back in the game. It's what we deserve with the chances we've created. Port Vale came from behind to win at Pride Park back in October and ruined Paul Warren's first outing at Pride Park as Derby boss. Can they find some redemption here? Springer tries to win it. It's kept it in play. Dobbin. Urge forward. Good cross. These Rams are relentless. It's Nathaniel Mendes Lang. And just like that, Derby have turned it around. 87 minutes of frustration, Owen. And then a minute and a half of pure brilliance. Lewis Dobbin involved in both opportunities. All the works come from him down the left-hand side. Great play in the first place to keep that ball in. And at this point, Lewis Dobbin gets past two players like they weren't there. Wonderful ball into the front post. And I've questioned the quality in front of goal over the course of the game. And the two moments that count. McGoldrick first, Mendes Lang seven, second, wonderful finish. Goes the corner, the goalkeeper's up, it almost met Stevens. Back with Worrell, measured ball in, a cross goal! It was begging for a touch, begging for a touch, but no one could get on the end of Dan Jones's header. Well, it's a brilliant ball back into that danger area, over the top of the Derby defenders. Nobody picks up Jones, completely free. And Nathaniel Mendes Lang, his first to it. Goals and back-to-back games for him now. Oh, he's pulled it back. Dobbin might get the chance. Dobbin! Off to the underside of the bar and away. What does he have to do to get on the score sheet this evening? Oh, he changed the game with how involved he's been. Derby County have done it. With two minutes left of normal time, they trail Port Vale by a goal to nil. But in a minute and 45 seconds, Paul Warren's team turned it around. First David McGoldrick with his 12th of the season. And then Nathaniel Mendes Lang with a thrilling finish at the front post. Lewis Dobbin, the Sunday team, involved in both goals. Some revenge for Paul Warren after Port Vale ruined his home debut back in October. And nearly 4,000 Rams fans have been there to see it in person.